another day, another day is selling Theta. Um, day after Martin Luther King Day. Markets are closed yesterday, open again today. Uh, so we went ahead and sold some calls on QQQ when it was up. Uh, we did that on Friday on SPY, um, and then we re-rolled them. So those expire in a couple of days. For Apple, uh, the SPY ones are going to expire today worthless. We had 404 calls. They were expired worthless. We only got $33 out of that. Um, <clears throat> but still something. QQQ was solid. Made a nice 150 on that. Plus, we made $50 from another call that we did on it today. And then rolled them for tomorrow, 286. And SPY was up again. Um, and yeah, that's really the strategy right there. Just basically just selling calls. Uh, we entered a long position on... Goldman, but um, probably should have done more. We only sold one put, but we'll make 58 bucks if it stays above 332 and a half. It's 350, so it'd have to fall a lot more. Um, but again, we only got $58 out of that. <clears throat> Playing it safe, just trying to make a little bit every single day. Um, Amazon, we saw our short position, we're up 72% on that, $32. Uh, Ford, two puts sold, 18 bucks, you know, little things like that, but they do add up a lot. Um, thought about shorting Tesla, um, but I'll wait for tomorrow if it goes up again and then maybe do a little bit of a short play on that. Like I said, like a 140 call on it for Friday and try to cook like a hundred bucks, something like that. But yeah, that's honestly about it. Uh, as long as QQQ stays under 286 tomorrow, we'll pocket another $90. So again, that's the goal over a hundred a day. <sighs> that's all you need to do to play. So that's what we're doing. Hope you guys enjoy. See you in the next video. Peace.